awesome. I had an awesome conversation with Rob and Gust. The rent was $4.75 short. So I wrote them a check. Didn't realize, didn't realize it was 1580, 15. 6475. I thought it was 1560 or 1550 475, and I was just going to overpay a little bit. Rats! That'll get you right in the middle of a deep thought, even. Hmm, hum. But it was worth it because we had some really good conversation. Um, I was like getting into the meditation. Oh, the focus. I see it. It's easy to get back to the more you train it. So see what you see, however, it comes to you. And you're right on target. And sometimes if you're listening or watching, I had a thing where I was, saw a person and I closed my eyes and start, still visualized like the outline of the person, the whiteness and the darkness, like I saw the image of it and was just letting it be there, letting it be there. And then it melted and I knew the person moved. I opened my eyes and the person was over right, like right here. And I was like, oh my God. I wasn't like, oh my God, I don't think, I, I don't know if I said anything at all, but I was pretty amazed that that, I didn't like knock it down, it just eventually it just went down, and when it did, I had the knowing that the person had moved. Maybe I saw through my eyelids a little bit, of course there was some light, and if you relax, maybe your eyes can see it. Maybe it's subconscious, the unconscious, like they are transmitting to me in my mind that they are moving. They're transmitting to everyone around them without realizing it because they know it. So I know it. Okay. I'm going to go back and uh, make my point. So the demon voice... I'm not going to call it a demon voice. It wasn't a demon voice. It was a, a, just a voice. It sounded what humanity calls demonic in the movies and stuff. But I think that's because humanity is afraid of itself and is afraid to confront itself. And I've been confronting myself so much that I confronted that and it's part of myself. It's part of everyone. A demon. The devil. It's part of everyone. It's, it's an aspect of humanity. It's an aspect of life of existence. Confront it or it will overpower you. Confront it. Take it down. Knock its ego down. You know that you are on par with it. You are the one that makes the choices, that does the learning, that transmits it. It is the reflector, the great reflector, the blanket over all existence. And it's solar powered. Send up your thoughts. Up, I only say up because that's where the, the light is coming from. Send out your thoughts. Oh, the voice that I was hearing was coming from over the hill, was coming from the man. It was strange. I confronted the man the night before. I walked up to it, had this really intense, powerful experience approaching it. And I have my hand up. I, I've shown the light up on its face. I, I have a hand here. These guys were there, like, looking at me and talking to me. And they looked like their eyes were wide, and I was talking to them. And then I was talking about language and about the internet. I brought the awareness with me. I didn't lose myself in this like, ah, I was still understanding what's happening and talking about the technology and using it and using the internet and video to explain it to a lot of people, enough people, so that we can make change with it. It's not a cliche. It's come to this point. Now. 